All right, here we are. We're in Durango. We just had uh, our breakfast, a bagel egg sandwich, and we're getting ready to go to the train station right behind us and get on the train to Silverton. Ready to go? Here we go. All, All right. aboard. <laughs> <laughs> when I got out of high school, out of tech school, I was a welder. They needed a welder. <laughs> so I worked on the maintenance away uh, uh, machine that was made in the United States, uh, RCO, rail changeout unit. Uh -huh. Took the 39s out and put the ribbon rail in. Yeah. I worked on that gang. What was your run? I ran out of Los Angeles. Just mostly local for quite a bit. Then I ran from Los Angeles to Las Vegas. Right. And then I finished up uh, when we purchased uh, Southern Pacific. Yes. I ran from Los Angeles to Yuma, Arizona. Back. Today, the Durango and Silverton Narrow Gauge Railroad continues to provide year-round train service, operating a historical train with rolling stock indigenous to the line. The locomotive used to pull today's trains are either oil-fired or coal-fired steam-operated and diesel. Steam locomotives are 1923 to 25 vintage and are maintained in top condition. I made a rainbow. Oh, I made a rainbow. The coaches each feature bathroom facilities and are heated during the winter months for passenger comfort. Open gondola cars provide a panoramic view of the mountains. Great. Great trip. Worth the trouble of yesterday? Oh yeah, worth the whole thing getting on this train right and seeing all this stuff. After Silverton's last remaining mine, the Sunnyside, closed in the early 1990s, the town became more dependent on tourism than ever before. Ironically, the train became just as important to the town's economic survival as when it first arrived in 1882, except now it carried tourists instead of carting away ore.
What you looking at? Oh, I'm trying to see if I can see the brake shoes on the wheels for the locomotive. Oh. Yeah. Like they're pretty good shape. <laughs> Yeah, it's his first night back, he wanted to go. Yeah, sorry, sorry.